Hi there guys, it's Chrissy with SelfMadeNewbie.com and in this video we're going to go through the best motherboards for mining or the best motherboards for crypto mining to be specific. Now I've tried to keep this list as comprehensive as possible, narrowing it down to my absolute favorite top five picks. So no matter what you're looking for, there'll definitely be something on this list for you. So before we get into it, drop a like and subscribe and hit the bell to be updated with new videos. Okay, so I'm gonna skip any fluff talk and just jump right into my favorite options. And if you wanna confirm what they are, go to the list below in the description to confirm and also ensure you get the best pricing. So jumping in with my recommendation for best mining with newer overclocked GPU cards. And this is the Asus Prime Z390P. This is a solid choice for cryptocurrency mining if you're looking for longevity and reliability because it's equipped with over voltage protection technology and fortified PCIe slots to prevent damage that could occur when you attach heavy GPUs. M.2 supports ultra fast data transfer speeds of up to 32 gigabytes per second and this allows you to further customize your mining experience by optimizing cooling temperatures for GPU and CPU intensive tasks. Further customization is of course achieved through overclocking and it is compatible with nearly any type of video card. So some of the features, advanced fan control cooling mechanism powered by Fan Expert 4 with AIO pump, Simplified DRAM overclocking stability due to Asus Optimum 2. Four RAM slots with support for 64 GB, uh, DDR4 4266, 13 USB ports, gaming ready with immersive onboard HD gaming audio. One display port with HDMI and M.2 slot supports for SATA drives. Um, and AMD Crossfire X Multi GPU support. So the pros of this allows pairing with a broad range of traditional to RGB infused memory kits, easy to install, use and tweak, run many processes simultaneously thanks to RAM support of up to 64 gigabyte, and you can build your own RAID, up to 10 setups with SATA HDs, SSDs, or two M.2 SSDs. The cons, no built-in Wi-Fi, but you can connect to a Wi-Fi device and also no power switch. So this is great for customized mining experiences, whether you wanna try aggressive overclocking, tweak cooling on tasks, or build your own RAID. It delivers protection against over voltage and, or, and connecting heavy GPUs. The next one on my list is my recommendation for a, the best multi and hybrid GPU mining together with also gaming as well. So while other motherboards are designed for gaming and then adopted for cryptocurrency mining, this one is specifically designed for mining, uh, but the later can also be adopt, adopted. The manufacturer does provide a mining setup guide right from the website, unlike others where you would need to search around for the same information. This in addition to their live update and app shops for those who want to keep optimizing their systems. Nevertheless, the motherboard is equipped with an excess of PCIe slots, advanced system power connectors for stability, and support for up to 13 GPUs during multi-GPU mining operations. It can be used for AMD and NVIDIA hybrid mining as well. For instance, you can hook together five NVIDIA and eight AMD GPUs in hybrid mining. It is also compatible with other mining OSs such as Simple Mining and ETH OS. So what I like about this, Due to the 13 GPU setup, there is a cost saving on components since miners do not require additional CPU or RAM modules, storage or other components. It delivers space saving with one PC occupying less space than two. Additional power hookups and an eight phase power supply deliver consistent power. Um, support for hybrid and multi GPU mining, full spike protection for power surges, solid capacitor design for longevity, 8th and 9th generation Intel Core process support with Intel 300 series chipset motherboard. The cons, difficult to fully exploit the potential, for instance, are fixing 13 GPUs in multi-GPU mining because GPUs are not easy to find and they're not cheap either. This is also priced a little bit higher. So all in all, a great choice given it's 13 GPU, multi-GPU and hybrid GPU mining, in addition to being specifically made and optimized for mining rather than gaming, um, and all the guides, live updates and extras um, make this a really good premium pick. The next one on my list is my recommendation for sort of the reverse. So best for gaming together with mining, but if gaming is your primary objective. So this is a gaming motherboard in short, but it is still well adapted for mining operation with support for 10th and 11th generation Intel Core Pentium and Celeron processors. It is probably the most high-end 
cryptocurrency mining motherboard you can get in the market for gaming as well. It also upscales in terms of network connectivity with its 2.5G LAN and Intel Wi-Fi 6E solutions and achieves better overclocking ability as it has the latest Z590 chipset, which can also reach up to 5,333 megahertz when overclocking. It also features support for multi-GPU mining given the multiple uh, up to four generation four PCIe slots and two-way MD Crossfire technology to optimize the simultaneous operation of GPUs. RAM supports up to 128 gigabytes, although you would need an IMC on the CPU to reach those speeds. And besides, it is a budget-friendly option compared to many others on this list. So what I like about it, number one, it's affordable, integrated Bluetooth and Wi-Fi 6E support, support for high-end data transfer on USB 3.2 and Type-C ports, and no BIOS tweaks are required to stop multi-GPU mining. The cons are the VRAMs overheat a little when overclocking, so do be wary of that. So all in all, you're gonna get solid performance with this in terms of overclocking. Uh, in addition to support for high-speed USB 3.2 and Type-C sports. And it also features the latest chipset and is considerably affordable once again. The next one on my list is my recommendation for the best over voltage protection with static and lightning protection to boot. And this is the Asus B250 Mining Expert. So this is specifically made and optimized for crypto mining with 19 PCI slots and USB 3.1 ports. It also features the longevity and reliability aspects of Asus motherboards thanks to over voltage protection, safe slot core and lang guard technologies. It's suitable for multi-GPU mining and can, can support up to 19 NVIDIA or AMD GPUs in parallel. Tests reveal that it can generate up to 407 MHS hash rates while mining with 19 GPUs and 123.3 MHS with 6 GPUs. What I like about this, you can save costs by cutting down requirements for additional CPUs, memory and drives that deliver equivalent mining resources. It also achieves a TCO saving of up to $1.83 uh, um, when compared to some six slot motherboards. Generates up to 407 MHS with 19 GPUs and the voltage stability and hardware protection technology are really good here to give you longevity. The cons, difficult to exploit for the full potential um, and it is quite pricey as well. So all in all, it's not gonna deliver the highest overclock speeds for a motherboard, but it eases mining with support for up to 19 GPUs for those interested in multi-GPU mining without incurring extra costs on all the components needed to deliver an equivalent mining device. Now the final one on my list is my recommendation for the best option for easy setup with GPU state detection and also no power jumpers. And this is the BioStar TB360 BTC Pro. This is equipped with great capabilities to extend your GPU mining potential with up to 12 PCIe 3.0 slots on which you can hook up your 12 GPUs. The PCI slots allow USB riser cables to be plugged directly into it as well. This also helps save costs on additional peripherals. It saves you up to one extra computer compared to six GPU motherboards, for example. The additional peripherals would be needed to build a mining device of equivalent potential, basically. However, the TB360 Expert is better with more than half a dollar in savings per mega hash compared to the TB250 model. In addition, the PCI slot layout prevents current surges and short circuiting. Uh, and the Intel B360 provides each of the slots with a dedicated channel and this speeds up and maximizes the crypto mining potential. The motherboard also detects the GPU state on each PCI slot as well. So what I really like about this, easy BIOS setup software, uh, and that's needed to adjust the 12 GPUs. It's a budget friendly option as well. Maybe the cheapest on this list actually. It has support for ninth and eighth generation core processors, protection for lower surges and longevity, and saves costs for peripherals with the capability to hook up 12 GPUs. The cons are, there aren't that many product reviews on this, so you could say it's not as tested as some others on this list. 
And also the lower total RAM is only up to 32 gigabyte. So the verdict of this one, if you're looking for a motherboard with the capability to connect 12 GPUs, this could be an option for you. It comes with an easy BIOS setup utility as well to adjust the BIOS to support those GPUs. And again, this is another really affordable option as well. All right, guys, so hopefully there's something on this list for you, whether you're looking for something premium, something more budget, something in between, something for gaming, something for crypto and gaming. Yeah, hopefully there's something on this list for you. If you do have any questions though, drop them in the comments below. And if you found value with this video, drop a like and subscribe. I'll see you on the next one. Take care.